You can see through the paper. Welcome to 716 Montello Avenue. This is our front door. Let's <laughs> don't fall down on you. Go back, mongrels. This is our living room and our kitchen. Come on in. dishwasher so I don't have to move out. I can stay. We also have a lovely deck. We don't have any furniture on it yet, but someday. deck has a lovely view of the Columbia River, which we really enjoy. should pause for a minute to admire Justin's dishwasher cabinet, which he had to make under duress. Good job, honey. All right. You might hear the sounds of a backhoe in the background. We think our neighbor is digging a swimming pool. Baby safety gate for safety, which I can neither get in or out of. And the nursery, which is still under construction, excuse me. I have to stay to get the dog out. But it's coming along. That's Airely's bed and Woodrow's. We've got a few more shelves to hang and things to do, but I think we're pretty ready. And this is their view, and I'm not sure if the camera will get mount at them. They actually have a good This is the master bathroom. There is a bathroom downstairs, but we're not going to show it to you because it's where the dogs and everything else lives. It's also our storage room. This is our master bathroom, which thanks to IKEA has been reclaimed from the lands of oak cabinetry.
And this is the bedroom slash nursery because the babies will be living in here for at least the first six months or so. And they're both super. We have lots of space up here. We really love it. Our cozy fur from Grimmy and Pop Marable. And our rocking chair from Grandma and Grandpa Jones. And the cribs you saw in the outer room from Grandma and Grandpa Humphrey. But I also have a pretty spectacular view from my rocking chair of Mount Adams and the river. It's a nice place to spend time with the babies. We also have a lovely porch, also known as Baby Death Trap, where we have more stunning views of the Columbia and Washington on the other side of the river. Um, there is a lovely downstairs guest room, but I'll let that be a surprise for those of you who have not yet visited. Um, but we love it. It's starting to feel like home, and it definitely feels like a good place to bring the twins. I think there'll be room for us all, at least to begin with. So we love you, and we're really grateful for everything that you've done to help us make this a home. Thank you so much. Thanks so much.